Happy Catter Day. So I made one of these already. Ooh. And I like how it came out. So let's do one together. So I'm using Tailored Expressions 6x6 Designer Masking Stencil with the rectangles. So it comes with four sizes. Well, four stencils. These are cut out of here. Wahoo. And this one goes into this one. Oh my god. So we are using Distress Oxides in Worn Lipstick, Pinked Raspberry, and Seedless Preserves. So this is what I did for this one because I'm kind of testing these out. And I'm using the Picket Fences Blender Brushes. So I'm not the best with blending. I feel like mine never come out as dark as I'd like them to. I don't know why, but whatever. I go in circular motions. I'm using the Make Art Station by Wendy Vecchi, which I like a lot too. I bought it primarily for stencils, because I feel like even when I tape stencils down, they kind of move. I don't know if you other crafty people have that problem. I don't know, they just always move, and it's like, ugh! Then I get just fucking pissed off about it. Deedly dee, da 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 da. So it's sunny up here at the moment in good old Connecticut. It's chilly. But I saw some people down in the south, down in Georgia, and it's like snowing. Look what the fuck is going on? Oh, there's no climate change. Yeah, okay, my ass. But we won't talk about that, will we, today? No. So, okay, can you see that I put down, I did the worn lipstick. And a little more. A little more here in the middle. I don't know, just, I feel like when I do blending, it takes me forever. And I see other people do it, and it's done in no time. So, I don't know. I don't know. So I always cap mine in between, and then I know I still have to like wipe these off a little bit. So I'm gonna go into get some pink raspberry. I love that color. It's almost like a dragon fruit color. Oh my god. Dragon fruit, a little dragon fruit color. Oh no. Okay. I'm gonna move this a little bit. Because it is kind of slippery. Even though it is magnetic, it is. I feel like it's still slippery. Got a little slippery. Slippery. Do, 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 do. That's physical from Olivia Newton John. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 Deedle, deedle, dee, dee, dee. This is what I do when I have the house to myself. No wonder I have it to myself. <laughs> All right. So now you want to go back in with your lighter color and go over where you blended these two. So that'll be somewhere around here. Oh, shit. See, it's like... Uh... And just to get that... Deedle, dee. Right, a little, do a little more. All right, I think that's good enough. So then that is done for now. All right, they're gonna go into some seedless preserves. Pretty. Probably shouldn't really be putting this red into the purple, but whatever. I do like this, um, when you buy the Make Art Station, it does come with a ruler. Which is kind of cool too, but I don't want to get it dirty. I actually don't like getting dirty when I'm crafting. Go figure. Isn't this pretty though? I really, this is my first time using these stencils and I'm really loving them. Because they make it so easy for you to put down color or to, um, you know, just, you have that certain area on your card. So there are etched lines, and I'll show you after I do this, there are etched lines in these stencils. So your A2 card, 
you can fit it right over your A2 card perfectly, and that is your four and a quarter by five and a half card. All right. Dee da do da do do da do 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 da do do da do. Oh shit! Sorry, I wasn't gonna sing. I should make jingles. I think I missed my calling. Well, that'd be plagiarizing, I guess, but you know what I mean. <laughs> I know I'm a dork. So we do the sealess preserves. And we're gonna go back in and we're gonna go over that into here. And just go where these two blended. See, I don't wanna get the magnets dirty either. Oh, curr. I don't wanna get them dirty. All right, I like that, I think. Let's see. Cap that and then just put this aside. Let's see. Oh my god! Look at that! That's really nice. I like it. So then I'm probably gonna die cut because I'm thinking of Happy Valentine's Day for these, so I'm thinking I'm gonna die cut Happy Valentine's Day or something. I'm not totally sure yet, but I did want to just play with these stencils. So see, let's see up here. There's lines up here. Try to see. Yeah, see that? Yes. Ah, there we go. Wahoo. So you that's how you line up your paper with it. So you put your paper down, and then you line up these um, etched marks over, you know, so it fits your paper. So then you just get it right in the center. Wahoo, people. All right. She also has um, one with a heart in the center, which I'm going to pick up tomorrow. Um, that's my goal for tomorrow. Because <laughs> I really want to... I have some ideas for that for Valentine's Day. So thanks for watching. That's my first technique video, I think. Thanks. Have a good Saturday. Stay warm.